Hey, it's Mastin, and we are on day five of riffing on A Course in Miracles. D, I'm going. Stop. Ooh, that's fast. Yeah. Right or left? Right. Top or bottom? Top. All right. Thank God you chose the top because the bottom is empty. <laughs> All right. No freaking way. Same one as the first day. Come on. What are the chances? Come on. Yet you can learn the truth about yourself from the Holy Spirit who will teach you that as part of God, deceit is in you is impossible. When you perceive yourself without deceit, you'll accept the real world in place of the false one. And then your father will lean down to you and take the last step for you, raising him to yourself. Well, good Lord, sounds like you and I need to talk about this one again. What are the odds that we're going to get the same dang passage out of these, I don't even know, 500 something pages? Holy cow. All right, so let's talk again because <laughs> you needed to hear it again. All right. Don't worship money, don't worship success, don't worship significance or comparison, how big your Facebook page is or how big your business is, how much money you're making. That's not who you are. That's not what's most important. Stay focused on what you value, on your spiritual practice, on your creator, on your higher power, on being of service. Stay in that lane of recognizing what is true and what is real. You come from a divine source, you are a divine being, and you have an opportunity here to step into something greater but you can't worship money and be happy. The more you chase money, the less of it you'll have. The more that you chase significance, the less of it you'll have. The most significant thing that you can do is to be a loving presence, and the best thing that you can do to make money is to focus on how can you serve, how could you add value, how could you solve problems. That is the name of the game. So get your mind right, for God's sake. You forgot, now you're gonna remember, so now I'm teaching you to remember to never forget. Focus. All of your intention. What does Jesus say? Love God with all your heart, mind, and spirit. Right? And the second law is love your neighbor as yourself. That's the name of the game. Fall in love with creation. Fall in love with your creator. Call, fall in love with your purpose. Fall in love with your dharma. Fall in love with the pursuit of your personal development. That is the name of the game. Get your mind off just making money. Get your mind off just finding success. And focus on something larger than yourself. This is Mastin. And A Course in Miracles telling you for the second time this week, get out there, take action, and make it real. We'll see you soon.